Another tool at your disposal for creating PDF documents is Media Convert. Media Convert is a web-based program that requires no downloads, and it can be found in the digital backpack on our school webpage. So if you click on the digital backpack, it will open up a directory of various different online programs that you can use for pretty much anything that you'd want to do uh, with the computer. And uh, so if you go down to c File Converters <coughs> and then uh, go over to Media Convert, click on the icon, it'll bring you to the program Media Convert. And uh, Me Media Convert is a completely free free program and they pay for it through advertising. As you can see this page is littered with advertisements. Um, although I do believe that you can purchase a, a more powerful service, but for our purposes we can just use the free service. So if you click on browse, we can browse for a document. In this case, I'm going to try and find a uh, Word document, but any document will work. So um, let's see here, what would be a good one to use? Let's go ahead and choose this Microsoft versus OpenOffice doc. This is a this is a document um, comparing and contrasting both of these programs. Now it automatically detected that it was a Word document, which is good. And so if I scroll down here to the bottom part of well not the bottom part, just a little bit down, we'll see output format. And we can choose from any number of output formats, one of which is a PDF file. Although if you if you wanted to turn turn this into an open office document or a HTML page or um, or any number of these other text documents that are available here, you can. But because we're dealing with PDF files in the session, I will choose PDF. And by clicking OK, you accept the terms. And so what this does is it will upload your file to their website, and it will and it will uh, process the conversion, and then it'll give you a, a link to where you can download the new PDF file. This this can take anywhere from a couple a couple seconds to um, 10 or 15 minutes, depending on the size of the file. But for most document files, it doesn't take that long. So here we are, it's finished converting it, and we can go and click download. It prompts us to either save or open. I'm going to go ahead and open it with Adobe Acrobat Reader. <coughs> and here's the document file that um, previously was a doc file, and now is a PDF file. Again, the reason for doing this would be not everyone has Microsoft Word, and so if you wanted to publish documents on your website <coughs> for other people to open, PDF is a very safe document file that uh, most people can open. And if they can't, they can always download Adobe Acrobat Reader and, and, view, and view these documents free of charge. So that is... Uh, that's Media Convert, very useful program, and uh, I hope you find it useful as well.